Congratulations on your purchase of the WK210 from Costco. The software that's included with this keyboard is a wonderful way to get started in the world of computer-based music production using the included N-Track software. In this video, we will show you how to hook up your WK210 to your computer via USB and then download and authorize the music production software. So let's get started. Here's what you'll need. Your computer, your WK210 owner's manual, turn to page 59, and your WK210. In order to hook up your WK210 via USB, you'll need a USB cable, just like the one you use for your printer. I took this one from home. Don't tell my wife. Here in the manual, there's a description of the process we're going to go through to connect your Casio WK210 to your computer. First, turn off your Casio and turn on your computer. Take the USB cable and connect it from the keyboard to the computer. Now it's time to install the N-Track software. Go to www.ntrack.com slash Costco and follow the instructions to download the program. Once it's downloaded, you'll need to run the installer. Now make sure you have your registration number in front of you. The N-Track software needs to know what device you are using. Your choices will appear as Casio USB MIDI or in Windows XP as USB audio device. Now you can use your WK210 to input MIDI data, not only into the N-Track software, but into any MIDI application. MIDI is a special language that electronic musical instruments use to communicate with each other and also with computers. MIDI lets you record a part using one sound and have it play back on another. It also lets you build up different sounds on drum, bass, and keyboard parts and control them independently. MIDI opens up a whole world of incredible opportunities for composition and performance. But what if you want to record your voice or guitar on top of this? To do this, you will need a special piece of equipment called an audio interface. That converts the signal from a mic or guitar or audio output from your Casio into digital data. If you want to find out more about computer-based recording, we can recommend the following websites and materials.